Investigators are looking into what caused a fire at a house in Colorado Springs this morning. A man was found dead outside of the home, but police say he didn't die in the fire. It happened in the 2400 block of Tahoe Boulevard. That's near Airport and South Circle. KRDO News Channel 13's Dana Molina is live there now with new information. And Dana, what's the situation there now? Rana, Rob, take a look at the scene behind me. We're here off Tahoe and Sequoia. As you can see, the street is blocked off by police tape. There is a police officer right here. And if we take a look over to the house where this fire happened, you can see that's still blocked off by police tape. There is a fire truck. We saw um, some fire investigators out there. And just a couple of minutes ago, we also saw some smoke coming from the house. Now, this all started in the morning when a man called 911 threat threatening to kill himself and set his home on fire. When police and firefighters got here, they found a man dead outside the home and the house was in flames. Firefighters tackled the fire but initially couldn't go in because they thought there could be improvised explosives inside. Police later confirmed there were no explosives. The man's identity hasn't been released. His neighbors say they didn't know him very well. I've only talked to him, you know, including today, four times, the whole time he was living there. Because, like I said, he kept to himself, never seen him outside. Every once in a while, you'll see him outside. Jeffrey Carlson says he spoke with the man living in that house this morning. He says from the way he spoke, he knew something wasn't right. We'll have much more about that conversation coming up tonight at 5. For now, reporting live in Colorado Springs, Dana Molina, KRDO News Channel 13. Thank you for that.